This is hydrogen tap. What you're looking at is the third in the series on the Tower X that I'm putting together. This is just a test system. The tower consists of two sets of plates three, in, three inches by six inches long, top and bottom. They're separated by a space of about an inch. And that's so that as one set, the bottom set, pushes the water flow up with the hydrogen, it does the same. It creates a water flow through the second. And I believe that's going to create more hydrogen. And you can see there there is 20 plates in this set. What I'm going to have is 40 plates in the final system. The tower that this is going to be going into will be 15 inches tall by 4. This clear tower is 5.5 by 13.5, 5 across the top and 13 down, which means there's a considerable amount of water in here. The water is or has lye in it for the electrolyte in its distilled water. You can see how the plate's been put together and there's the gap. And I'm going to put a 12 volt system across here. And it's going to be reading about a little over 30 amps because of the amount of lye I've got in here. At almost 13 volts. So I'm pushing it. Now let's see how this thing works. Okay, we're on it now, running I'm going to take this off so that you get a better view of it so there's no power on it right now Take another shot at this. And we're running. Here we go. It's better. Okay. Okay, let it cool down a bit here and we're going to take another look at this. What I'm going to do is get a look at the section. And I'm putting it on putting it on now. Taking it off. Okay, we're going to try it again here. This time you can get a better view of it.
the it's creating a flow through the center very little is coming out the side there's your flow Turn it off here. So it looks like what I'm after is actually happening. So right there we're getting a flow which is pushing up between the plates on the top. This is running almost 30 amps at uh, 13 volts, but that's okay. I'm pushing it. That's because of the electrolyte I put in there. The power is off now. You can see it's still going a little bit here. So this is one section of the tower that I'm putting together and it's going to be going into a a tube just like all the other Aaron cells that are four inches across only this one's going to be 15 inches tall and this is only one section there's going to be 40 plates in it so you can figure out the area of that so each plate is 3 by 6 times 40 times 2, both sides of each plate. There is a discoloration in the water here. And that's most probably due to the fact that I didn't wash these plates off. on the top this is this is just the bubbles it is producing so much hydrogen bubbles that you can see if I swirl this around they'll finally dissipate this is not junk in the water this is just bubbles Now you can see them. There's just so many of them. It's producing quite a lot of hydrogen there. Okay, what I'm going to do is attempt to get this out of here, which may or may not work. Show you exactly what I'm working with. can see the plates pretty well. Okay, and there they are. And you can see that tower, the gas